what's up y'all i am i am about to go get my hair cut i really don't know how to feel i'm not even gonna lie it's probably gonna be like an emotional type of thing for me but yeah i'm going to get my hair cut right now i just got to well i didn't just get i got to la at like seven now i'm on the way to get my hair cut this is the last time y'all gonna see this pony the pony is about to be gone i'm about to be bald this is literally how i'm about to look like this <laughs> i can't wait i can't wait i'm about to cut my hair off oh my god i've been waiting on this moment and of course i couldn't let anybody else cut my hair besides the only person that i would really let put some scissors to my hair Y'all will see her soon. Uh, I'm literally about to be a baldy. <laughs> I'm about to be a baldy. Shabaldy. <laughs> I'm about to be so bald. I cannot wait. This is like super exciting. I'm, I'm probably going to cry. I know I'm probably going to cry. <sighs> because it's my hair. Like, like for me... This is an attachment, but it's an attachment that I need to let go of. Like, it's time to, so I'm super excited about that, but let me get off of here so I can actually record while I'm getting my hair cut. Alrighty, we're doing a big chop today. Let's see what we got In this very moment, all I could think about was, I finally did it. It's gone. Like, no more hair struggles, no more trying to figure out what I'm gonna do with my hair today, other than put it in a ponytail. And if I could use one word to describe this moment, it would be free, totally free. For 30 years, this hair has been growing out of my head. And I've cut my hair a number of times before this, but never this short it was time for me to just start over because at a certain point i was no longer giving my hair the tlc the tender love and care it deserved and honestly i was just completely over my hair from the countless split ends the knots and tangles on wash day wash day taking me most of my day I just became tired of everything. I became tired of flat ironing it. And if you know me, you know I loved my straight hair. You got a guy. 
My hair was very long, absolutely gorgeous. I loved my hair even though I didn't always when I was younger. Believe me when I say I begged my mama for a perm for years when I was younger, but she never let me do it and she always told me <laughs> to love the hair that God gave you because some people ain't even got hair, okay? <laughs> Anyways, now that the damage, the weight, and everything that has lived through my hair the last 30 years is now gone. It's certainly time for change. And it's just time for me to create new experiences throughout my new hair journey. So I hope y'all love the hair absolutely as much as I love my hair. I love this haircut on me. It makes me feel real grown, real sexy, like the back of the cut is doing it for me. Everything is just doing it for me and I'm doing it for me. I'm not doing it for nobody else but me. Like I love it. This is everything that I've wanted, everything that I've dreamed of for the past, I don't even know how many years, but I always knew I would get to this point of I'm going to cut my hair off one day and I stuck to the number 30, and here I am today. 30 years later, I'm back. <laughs> but I hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. I hope y'all enjoyed my little rants about my hair journey. And stay tuned for more because, of course, I'm about to be showing y'all how I style this short hair because this is a new journey for me. And so I want to bring y'all along with it as we start over and give Tiffany a whole new vibe. All right. I love y'all. Bye. My favorite part of um, short cuts is the, the back. Yeah. I can't even see the back. I'll have to show you. I'm so in the mirror. Because that's what makes the um the cut sexy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The neckline. so much this yeah, is welcome. beautiful yeah. i love it this is miss lisa didn't she do a wonderful job thank you so much yeah. <laughs> it's good thing i cannot believe i cut my hair look at it it looks totally different <laughs> I mean, like, completely different. This is super cute. But, oh my God, I cut my hair. I'm still getting used to it. <laughs> Zion gonna see me and be like, girl, where your head at? <laughs> Who are you? You are not my mother. <laughs> oh. I'm real cute as a baldy. It looks exactly how I envisioned it was gonna look. And I can't wait to like just slick it down though and do myself some finger waves. I'm gonna wear it like this for the next couple days though. Well, for like the next two days. Malia's mama, so kind, 
gave me her travel kit. So I have, because I didn't bring no products. So I have all of the My Curl products in hand, on deck, sample size to fix this hair. Thank you, Miss Lisa. I really appreciate it because, yeah, I would have been out here a baldy and not looking like nothing. Okay. All right. Bye.